Welcome back to Infiga, my dear friends. In this video, we have another very interesting and challenging question from radical equations. And we have to find out real solutions only. So let's get started by writing our denominators cannot be 0. So x can't be 0. x can't be 1 over 7. Now I will write our equation as fourth root of let us take x square common from numerator. So 33 plus 1 over x square over x square common from the denominator 7 minus 1 over x plus fourth root of x common. So 7 plus 1 over x over x and right hand side is fourth root of 256 x over x is common. 7 minus 1 over x. Now we can cancel from numerators and denominators. x square x square here, x and x here, x and x here as x is non-zero. Now I will write here fourth root of 33 plus 1 over x square over 7 minus 1 over x plus fourth root of 7 minus 1 over x equal to fourth root of 256 over 7 minus 1 over x. Now let us call 1 over x equal to a. When x is not equal to 1 over 7, so a cannot be 7. So I can write equation as fourth root of 33 plus a square over 7 minus a plus fourth root of 7 minus a equal to fourth root of 256 over 7 minus a. Let me write our equation here. So I can write equation as fourth root of 33 plus a square over 7 minus a plus fourth root of 7 plus a equal to fourth root of 256 divided by 7 minus a where a cannot be 7. So I can multiply this equation by fourth root of 7 minus a. Let's multiply. Fourth root of 33 plus a square will be left plus fourth root of 7 plus a times 7 minus a equal to fourth root of 256 only. Now right hand side if I will simplify then this is 4 power 4. So fourth root and power 4 will be over. So finally RHS is 4. And here I can write our radicand 7 plus a times 7 minus a using difference of two squares identity. It will be 7 square minus a square or 49 minus a square. So our equation will become fourth root of 49 minus a square. This equation. Let us write here fourth root of 33 plus a square plus fourth root of 49 minus a square equal to 4. Now I will use substitutions. Let us consider our first radicand. This one as u power 4 and second radicand v power 4. So the very first equation which I can write it would be fourth root of u power 4 
plus fourth root of v power 4 equal to 4. Fourth root and power 4 will be cancelled out. So it will give us our first equation u plus v equal to 4. Now I will use the substitution equation. This one. So I can write second equation as u power 4 plus v power 4. This will be equal to 33 plus a square plus 49 minus a square. Plus and minus a square will be over. So u power 4 plus v power 4 will be equal to 49 plus 33, 82. Let us say this is equation 2 and let us call this is equation 1. I will write here u power 4 plus v power 4 equal to 82 with u plus v 4. Now I will consider a squaring of second equation first. So I can write u square plus v square plus 2uv equal to 16 or u square plus v square equal to 16 minus 2 times uv. Again I will consider squaring both sides. So power 2, power 2. So I can write here u power 4 plus v power 4 plus 2u square v square. This will become 256 plus 4u square v square and minus 64 it would be uv. Once I will plug in the value of u power 4 plus v power 4 equal to 82 in LHS, we will get quadratic equation. So I will be writing here 82 plus 2u square v square equal to 4u square v square minus 64 uv plus 256. Once I will simplify, I will be getting u square v square minus 32 uv plus 87 equal to 0. This will be our quadratic equation. Let us solve this one. u square v square minus 32 uv plus 87 equal to 0. Now if I will factor 87 then it is 29 times 3. So I can split our middle term as minus 3 uv minus 29 uv plus 87 equal to 0. u times v it is common uv minus 3 minus 29 is common uv minus 3 equal to 0. So uv minus 3 times uv minus 29 equal to 0. So I can conclude uv equal to 3 and 29 from here. Now our first equation was u plus v equal to 4. Once I will club these two equations, I will write two system. First system would be u plus v equal to 4 with uv value 3. First system. And second system u plus v equal to 4 with uv value 29. Let us solve both the systems one by one. So I will write u plus v equal to 4 with uv 3 and u plus v equal to 4 with uv 29. So I can think about one quadratic equation whose roots are u and v. Then this equation is sum of roots equation and this one is product of roots. Now I can write quadratic in u itself as u square minus sum of roots which is 4 here times u plus product of roots which is 3 here equal to 0. Similarly I can write 
equation here u square minus 4u plus 29 equal to 0. So finally we are having two quadratic equations. Let us solve one by one. I will use method of factorization here. I will be writing minus u minus 3u as minus 4u plus 3 equal to 0. Now u is common u minus 1 minus 3 is common u minus 1 equal to 0. So u minus 1 times u minus 3 equal to 0. Conclusion will be u equal to 1 and 3. Both are real values. Now second quadratic I will use quadratic formula u equal to minus b. So 4 plus minus square root of b square 16 minus 4 times 1 times 29. So minus 1 1 6 over 2 times 1 so 2. 4 plus minus square root of negative 100 which I can write over to 4 plus minus I can write a square root 100 it will be 10 and a square root of minus 1 it will be I over 2. So finally we are having two u values I will be writing here 2 plus minus 5 I because of this is complex so we can reject so I will write rejected as it is complex solution. So u equal to 1 and 3 will be accepted. So I will write here u equal to 1 and 3. Now the turn of substitution. What was our substitution? It was u power 4. It was 33 plus a square where a was 1 over x. So let us calculate u power 4 first. So u power 4 will be 1 power 4, so 1, 3 power 4, so 81. Now I will replace by 33 plus a square equal to 1, 81. Take away 33 from both sides. a square will be equal to negative 32 and 81 minus 33 is 48. Now a square we can write a square is negative. We know that i is equal to a square root of minus 1 and i square is equal to minus 1. So I can write this is 4 root 2 i whole square. And this one is 4 root 3 whole square. Now I will take a square root both sides. So a will become plus minus 4 root 2 times i or i times 4 root 2. And here it would be plus minus 4 root 3. Now a was 1 over x. So I will be writing here 1 over x equal to plus minus i times 4 root 2 and plus minus 4 root 3. Now I will take reciprocal. Flip numerator and denominator. So I can write here 1 over x first. It is equal to plus minus I will write 4 root 2 i and plus minus 4 root 3. Let's take reciprocal of both sides x will be equal to 1 over i times 4 root 2 with plus minus. Here 1 over 4 root 3 with plus minus. Now I can multiply here in i. So I need to multiply here with i. This will give us minus 1. So x will become minus plus i over 4 root 2. But we are looking for real solutions. We will cancel it. Plus minus 1 over 4 root 3. Because of this is complex, we can 
rigid. So the real solution which we are going to accept it would be plus minus 1 over 4 root 3 or plus minus root 3 over 12. This brings the end of the video. Do not forget to like, share and subscribe. Bye-bye till next video. Good luck and take care of yourself. Goodbye.